Welcome along to my channel. Today I'm doing my blessings coming to the sign of Gemini. And keep in mind that this will not resonate for all of you. If you like a personal reading, I'll leave that description down below. Another thing you do is we also have a website where things are for sale, things are for auction. There's gems, there's crystals, there's shirts, there's jewelry, and so on. Link to that will be in the description down below for you to check out, which you should do. Now on the bottom of the deck for the overall energy here, we have the Page of Swords. So Gemini, what has caught your attention? What has gotten you all fascinated about it? Is it a person? Is it a project? Let's see what that is. We have the Hierophant, which is Taurus. We have the Two of Pentacles. Nine of Wands. Eight of Swords. Two of Wands, Knight of Swords. Okay, Gemini, so there's decisions to be made here. Alright, a lot of a lot of decisions actually. First off, if you're a single Gemini, I see you having um Someone that really caught your attention and you're going to be de uh, deciding on whether or not to be with them. Because they're coming in with commitment here. If you're already with someone, I see you could have other options besides the person you're with. Now, I don't recommend that, but it's just what I see. And I see just like you kind of questioning whether or not to really commit yourself to things. Things that catch your attention like projects, work, you know, sort of things like that. Now on the bottom of this deck we have the Three of Cups. Three of Cups is reunion, Three of Cups is celebration, Three of Cups is joy. We have the Strength card, which is Leo. We have the Hermit, which is Virgo. We have the Seven of Wands. We have the Empress. Lovers, which is Gemini with the Two of Pentacles. Once again, it feels like you've got love coming in here, Gemini, and it's someone that you already know of. We have Gemini, Taurus, Virgo, Leo, or someone with those placements. And it's up to you to decide on whether or not to be with that person or to be alone. That decision's yours. And number three, with Blossoming Abundance. Abundance is coming your way. Answers. Answers, so answers to questions you've been having and answers to prayers. Number 36, the number 3 is important. Number 3, 36. The cosmos, ascend. I connect to oneness and expand my awareness. Because you connected to your oneness. You expanded here. You ascended. You're having answers to your prayer here. Gemini, you're having abundance coming into your life. So, that is all I have for you. Let me know if that resonates. Thank you for watching. If you want to see more content, don't forget to like, subscribe. Bye, guys.